hello everyone it's me is somebody welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorials and today i'll show you the fall color so i made the preset like this before one and after one and this one before image was like that and after one i got this color using this preset so before one and after one you're getting this let's start the tutorial if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications i'll show you all the setup in this photoshop how you will do this type of fall color in photoshop so let's open up or you can delete this one this is our main image or you can go file and open up and you can just insert your photograph whichever do you like i'll prefer you the greenery background e will be the best result if you apply this technique so press ctrl or command j it'll make another copy by pressing this and after that we'll give this one if a double l fall and then going to the filter and camera filter so camera filter is under plugins in the photoshop i'm using the 15.0 and you'll get the up updated or the new version in my video description if you want so after that here is three the dots which is the menu options and load settings options i made a preset for you that is the fall modern color and you'll get this one instantly so before one and after one so what i have done over here let's see the settings and if you don't have this preset you can use these the settings by using the settings you can do like that so here the temperature plus 18 to 0 and the exposure 0.25 and the contrast plus 35 one thing is that if you can apply in this technique in lightroom you can apply and you will get the same result in the lightroom so here the highlight minus 100 and the shadow plus 100 and the whites minus 25 and blacks plus 30 that's good and vibrance which is the minus 49 and the saturation plus 40 that's good and let's going to the curve options here the curve like that and the red curve will be like this and the green curve will be like this and the which is the blue curve which is like this and then the detailing options sharpening amount 35 if you want you can de reduce or reduce the value of this 15 uh, it depends on the sharpness if you don't want total like a uh, sharp you can reduce that but i would suggest to noise reduction which is the color noise and that is the 25 and if you expand this one that will be the 50 and 50 percent that's good color mixture important part of this tutorial and here is the portions hue saturation luminance intensity of the color hue is the which color will be and the saturation will be the percentage of the color and here hue i used here plus 20 and the orange plus 5 yellow as it is 0 and the green minus 100 and the aqua plus 1 and the blue minus 75 and the purples plus 15 and the magenta that is plus 25 saturation i made the minus 100 1 2 3 4 colors that means the yellow green aqua and blue and rest of the thing is the minus value here minus 10 plus 5 and minus 25 and minus 30 luminance i made the luminance up this one the orange yellow and the these two because of i want to make this one prominent and that's why the green minus and the reds that is minus 5 and let's go to the color grading i didn't use that and the optics i didn't use that geometry i didn't use an effect i used some vignetting that is minus 26 and the calibration three primary colors red green and blue and here minus value of the hue and the saturation zero and you know that hue which color will be and the saturation percentage of the color and we are working here three primary colors and only this primary color will be effect if you get the value like this the green minus four and the saturation minus 25 and the blue primary that is minus 43 and the saturation actually plus 21 so we are working with this because of here in a color mixer you are getting those color but in this calibration options we are just fine tuning all the stuffs like this and that hit okay so getting the result like this before and after before after all the steps is nice if you want to make or add more uh, filters you can use that it's totally up to you and uh, that is your choice so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any sort of queries please do comment in my video comment section don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications until the next video is how i'm signing out today stay safe stay healthy keep me in your prayers bye bye